I'm talking to Ron Berenson, uh, who just drove in my Tesla autonomously. And I'm asking him what's new on cryptocurrency and blockchain in the last year. We see, uh, Ron, elements. what is new at the uh, blockchain world? What's new is that uh, the blockchain is getting more and more mature. People are getting on the one hand side the idea that blockchain is a very good uh, way to implement uh, supply chain solutions, uh, also in the financial sector. And on the other hand, uh, realism is kicking in. Uh, people see how difficult it sometimes is to get uh, blockchain solutions uh, really working. Mm -hmm. And I think it's a healthy next step in, in this industry to see where blockchain really can make a difference. Yeah, it seems like it's everywhere. I mean, it's in the political world, it's in the supply chain, it's in e-commerce, it's in, 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 in registries. Uh, what, what's happening with, uh, with the currency world? Uh, what's happening with the initiative of different uh, uh, central banks? So on the central bank side, uh, we are mostly working on blockchains as a technology uh, to see where uh, traditional fiat currencies uh, can benefit from this new technology rather than developing uh, cryptocurrencies. Mm -hmm. And on the cryptocurrency side, I see there is a, a niche uh, where people who are living in high inflation countries, people who are not well connected to the existing infrastructure, uh, there uh, the blockchain can still be of, uh, of, of, of value. Yeah, the, the, the traditional, the bitcoins, have also governance problems and, uh, and efficiency problems. Eh? Absolutely, yeah. That's what I said at the conference uh, last year. Uh, cryptocurrencies have a, have a governance problem. And I think that uh, even with all the new technologies, uh, governance uh, is always there and needs to be taken care of. Yeah, and it's more expensive to do a Bitcoin, uh, Bitcoin payment nowadays uh, because of the problems with the blockchain size than with our traditional uh, money system. That's true. Uh, a couple of years ago, I used to uh, exchange uh, freely Bitcoins with, with anybody I, I got into contact with and it was almost free and now it's about seven dollars uh, for for one uh, bitcoin transaction <laughs> and that's far too expensive yeah also so bitcoin is having trouble and blockchain is doing fantastically thank you